Morning team owners of both USFL Fantasy Football Leagues wanted to talk real quick about trading. We're going to extend the trade deadline by two weeks. I believe that'll take us till November the 15th. Uh, so you'll have to get it done. Uh, listen, look, there's some really good teams that maybe are risking it with one quarterback that might want to consider another quarterback. There's some of you teams toward the bottom that, uh, you know, <clears throat> feel like you just are not good enough to make it. You want to improve your team a little bit, take a little risk, and uh, not have two quarterbacks. You know, those are all possible trade items, and there are others, win-win uh, scenarios. Uh, so we're adding two more weeks. Uh, veto power uh, happens when 25% of the league, five uh, team owners uh, veto. Uh, please uh, do not vote unless you, uh, unless you um, uh, really feel the trade is unfair. And the guys that make the trade, I think you should do go on the stump and make that trade and do that. Really quick, I wanted to show you a couple of things. The main league page right there. You can do that on the phone. I, I don't know, the phone is a little bit different than here, but this is per PC or laptop. Uh, and then right there, rosters on the main page. If you simply go to rosters. Now, filling out the trade block is a good thing to do, but when you simply go to rosters, you are, you can see every team roster and you can look at the player, see when their bye week is. I suggest having just a bye sheet with you at all times, wherever you, when you work in fantasy football, especially right now with bye weeks. But uh, then you have proposed trade right down there. And if you hit that, simply hit that proposed trade and you simply look at both teams, you can sit there and trade and pick and pick what you want to do between your team and the team you're looking at. You can play with the whole thing and then hit cancel at the end and it's no harm done. Or you can hit finalize trade offer if you think it looks good. Uh, this is the fastest way. And uh, when you go to main league page and you go to rosters, you have every team there. You can sit here for you want to sit down for one hour and make a trade to five different teams that you think you can create a win-win scenario, I would do that. I would also go on the stump, both parties, if you feel you need to. Uh, I will warn you when it has, uh, it has more vetoes than it does, uh, you know, um, when, when the vetoes are getting close. But I would suggest going on the stump in the first place anyway. All right, guys. Good luck with your trades.